Um, sorry, Jean. Do you think you can help me look for my pants? I don't know where they are. Yeah, thank you. Uh. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Hello. I'm so sorry, but I'm Hello. really busy right now. I'll call you back later, okay? Hey. Love you. Bye. Oh, Clarissa, um, you're up next after the opening act. Can you go and stand by? Who are you? Um, I'm, I'm Annette. Annette Lee. Th this is my concert. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Hi, Bib! <laughs> oh my gosh, Chantel! Bib, thank you so much for the backstage pass! Don't mention it. Thank you so much for coming. Oh, Bib, let's take a selfie. Oh, okay, sure. So, Bib, you know, just now I overheard that you have an opening act for the show. Who is it, ah? Oh, it's Daniel Sid. I would love to introduce you, but unfortunately, he's leaving right after his set because he's got something on. Wait, so you mean I cannot take a picture of him backstage? Unfortunately, no. Uh, but I took a picture of everybody else backstage. I need to take a picture of all these famous people and text them on Instagram so their followers can follow me. Oh my god, I need to find him before he leaves. Wait, wait, wait. no. But Chantel, where, where are you going? He's on stage. He's on, he's on stage. Oh my god, no. Somebody please stop her. Sorry, sorry miss, are you... Hi, hi. hello. Hi, I'm an, uh, oh, so, uh, oh my gosh, you're the opening act, right? Yeah, Can I yes. take a picture with you? Um, for all my Instagrams? Just smiles. Wait, I need to do my, 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 my ring. I like, I like your hair, it's very lascus. Thank you, it's, uh, I put the um, tea tree cooked tea, tea. It's very nice. Thank you. Um, yeah. Miss, you're not supposed to be here. Uh, sorry, do you call me Miss? My, I, do you, sorry, do you Auntie, know? you're not supposed to be here. I'm sorry, do you, do you know who I am? No. I'm, I'm a famous influencer, you know. Chantel, you never heard of Chantel Tiffany. Everybody heard of me, right? You, you guys know her? Okay. Every, everybody heard of me. How come you never heard of me? Um, I don't have a phone. Actually, I think I can tell from your shirt. I think. Anyways, I have the backstage pass. Back, backstage? Stage. So backstage pass, you're, you're not supposed to be here. We're, we're Annette's show. It's, it's but you out. know, since, since I happen to come here, maybe I just take a photo with, with the audience. Maybe you help me take, you help me take. <laughs> Sorry, can you take? I, I think the angle is very weird. It's, I, I tried to do the Asian squad I see in the Jackie Chan movie. Um, can, sorry, no offense, but I think I take myself. <laughs> so, everybody smile. Okay, now everybody, you take um, me. I will pose. Security. And you just so, take a picture of me, and so then can, you can, just can, can post on your stage? Instagrams and t and text me. You don't have to take him. You can please, just please. We kind of need sorry, to stop the show. This, this, I can I wait uh, okay thank you thanks 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 bibs thanks bibs I'm just Singapore lady a lot of weird people uh. But who we are here for is Annette Are you guys ready for Annette's all in one show? <laughs> <laughs> thank you guys so much my name is Daniel Sidstagron enjoy your night
gondolod. So, um, hi, uh, my name is Kerry Sotong, um, and I'm reporting live for News Planet. Today we are at the first ever concert of Annette Lee. It's called Annette Lee All in One. And just before the show, we interviewed some Singaporeans on why they decided to come and attend the concert. So sit back, relax, and let's find out what they have to say. I wasn't going to come one. But then last minute, my project group wanted to have a meeting. So I come round, then I can see I'm... <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, no, 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 I don't know who she is. Yeah, I also don't know how I got a ticket. My friend gave me one, I think. <laughs> to be honest, uh, I don't really know what's happening. I am just here because my son brought me here. I'm influencer and I got backstage pass, so I come. <laughs> yeah. Eee, you also got backstage pass? Well, wait, then I don't go already. I didn't even want to come one. Anyway, I cut already, I cut already. You better just eat. Look at Snowy, look, Snowy. Snowy, look at the camera. So, we just want to say thank you so much for all the love. So, I am obviously here because uh, she's a national treasure. Yeah, just, just look at the architecture. She's beautiful. Uh, no, I meant why are you here to attend Annette Lee's concert? Oh, no, no, uh, I'm not here to attend any concert. I am just here at the Esplanade uh, for a walk. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, you've got the wrong person. Always we not on the list of ones most likely to succeed. If you're always striving, but never first, heard people say it's just some things you don't deserve. Well, you got good news, you qualify for something even greater than you realize. Cause what you see will never last, and one day you'll be slaying it for the race. Then this is your song Don't meet us hard, darling Your time will come Just keep on running, keep on fighting Victory's already yours If you're always awkward With a shy Not popular or cool No matter how you try If you're always broken Or beaten down Got far too many fears and faults
song that I just sang is called Song for the Underdog and it was the title track of my sophomore EP and it's a song about how sometimes it's okay if you didn't start out the best you still can win and it's not about how you start it's about how you finish right so um, I'm really 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 happy um, to have everyone here with me today because I was actually going to do an EP launch for this sophomore album in at the start of 2020 in March 2020 but it got cancelled because of COVID um, but now we are here back again and we're doing a show yay so this song is called Gold the song I wrote um, a few years ago when I visited a gold mine overseas it's a nice song about how, you know, your friends see the gold in you. So I want you to either hold the hand of the loved one you came with. If you're on a first date, then maybe no need. Cause like, weird. Don't touch your hand where you are. Yeah. It's too fast, okay? Then you're just, just sit there, it's okay, it's fine. Yeah. But you know, if you're here with your mom, with your brother, with your sister, with your friend, yeah, just get cozy and then let's just sing the song together with each other. Let's go. You used to tell myself I'm a mere mistake, nothing more than a waste of space. Who needs a phone when I was be myself, be myself up? But then one day you found me out, your discovery was might as well, it hit me like a shovel in the ground. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know that I was cold till you found me. song dedicated to the person it came with hopefully um, it's a fun song I like the song I like singing it um, so fun fact uh, the version that we just sang of gold right um, it's actually not the original version it was a co Korean remix version that I recorded during the pandemic during COVID right it's a really fun cross collaboration over zoom um, and we wait sorry wait. I think my mom's calling me what Dinner tonight, ah? I, Mom, I, I can't come back for dinner. I'm having a concert. Huh? What concert? Where? At 
the Esplanade. I uh, don't care. You come home. You come home. No, 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 no. I, I, I cannot. I, I cannot come back. Wow, you very disobedient. I tell you, I'm gonna find you now and drag you home. Ha, no, 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 mom, no, no, no. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um. Yeah, guys. So I, I think I, I think my mom's gonna come down to drag me home. So I think I'm gonna need to hide. Yeah. So. I'm just, I'm just gonna grab some friends to, to take over for a bit, okay? If that's okay. Yeah, just, just for a short while. Okay, I'll be right, be right back, be right back. What do you want us to do? Just, and, and just anything. What do you mean anything? Just, 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 just you, any, yeah, just anything. Just keep them what are you? at the end. Just. Hey, everyone! Hello, everybody! Okay, guys. Oh, this is fast, this yeah, is fast. fast. Yeah. Hi, guys. Hi, hi, nice to see everybody. I am aware that there are children here, okay? I, I am aware that. That's why Charlie is here. It's yeah, that's why they put me here. Maintain the G rating of this show, okay? <laughs> right? Uh, so, Charlie, I guess Annette wants us to do some stuff here. Yeah, honestly, I, I, I don't really know, bro. She didn't give me the script. You know what we could do, Charlie? Yes. You know what we well, could well, do? I really don't know. Tell me, tell me. Oh, mm. oh, uh, we okay. could yeah. give away some of Annette's items that I found. Oh. oh! Don't get too excited. You haven't seen the items yet. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Who's excited for a giveaway? Huh? Who's excited for a giveaway? All right. All right. That is a pen. It's a pen. You Why see? are you celebrating you see how a pen? Excited they are. This is the same pen that's used to write all the brilliant skits that you watch Annette do. <laughs> ah! <coughs> stand up. Stand up. Hey. Where? Where? Where, bro? Somewhere over there, la. somewhere <laughs> over there. Oh. Okay. <laughs> easy link. Okay, nice. this is a net easy link. Easy link card. Personal easy link card. Eh, uh, hello. Eh. Uh, <laughs> let, my, uh, I'm finding my, my, my daughter. You I know, know, I know. 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 Andy, a boy. A boy? A boy, a boy can, a boy, a boy can. Hello, everybody. Give Auntie chance, uh. I'm Andy Susan. Wow. Um, Andy, we're doing giveaways. You want yeah. to do giveaways, Duff? Andy, yeah. Andy can win or not? Uh, why you uh, want her easy link card? Yeah. Free thing all is good, what? If the ballot rolls your number, you can win. Uh. Uh, but Andy got no number. You got no number? Huh? Okay, okay, never mind. Andy, give the give away. Okay, we, you. we let you okay. give. Andy, we let you give. Andy, no need to win. All right. Okay. Give with you. Uh, this one? Who you at? Look at your ticket. Look at your ticket. Stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up. Stand up. Yeah! Hey. Sanitization. Uh. Right. Oh, it's alcohol free. It's a halal one. Who, Who is that? You? Woo! Okay, the next <laughs> item, Singaporeans love it, man. Bubble tea, Singapore, royal bubble tea. tea. Very Use good, next time you get free power. Hey. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, God, and somewhere up there. Ah, okay. Somewhere up there. Who, what's your name? That are they pointing. Ilman! What I didn't guy? know there was going to be an Ilman here. Ilman, why are you so energetic? Uh? You're supposed to be fasting, right? Alright. Wow, you're very good, uh. you find the thing from, from behind, is it? Ah, uh, oh. yeah, we found you know all this. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Hey, I think my, my, my husband called me. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, what was he doing when he was... Oh, okay. Hey, uh, hello, dear. Just want to tell you, uh, tonight you don't need to cook dinner, really, okay? Because I already bought for myself and the dog. Ha! Huh? Why you go and buy? I'm going to cook already, you know? Ah, uh, but you're not at home, what? No, i coming home already. I'm coming home. And you go take the packet, you keep in the fridge. I'll eat another day. i come home already. Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Yo, a stupid old man. I, I, uh, sorry, ah, uh, Andy need to go home already. Go, okay. go, go, Andy, go, go, okay. go. Yeah. Andy, go, ah. Uh. Hey, hey, thank you, ah. Uh. Thank yeah, you, yeah. Hey, thank okay. you, everybody. Right. Bye bye. Hey, um, so while Andy goes home to cook dinner, yeah. it's still we? gonna be us for a bit. Yeah. <laughs> so we got a couple more items, Charlie. Yes. And it is a, oh, voila. Ah. Go sabo, you know. Ah. You want yourself a. Who that? Where? Oh, there hey, you are! Hey. hey! Congratulations, Congratulations! Bro. Yeah, you won yourself an ART kit! This! Wap! <laughs> Wait, go, go, go. <laughs> Do the honors. Alright, let's roll it! Who's there? For your top BB number top! Congratulations, oh, bro! Up. Lucky winner, give him a round of applause! Give him a round of applause! Hey! It's a portable charger. Second hand, it belongs to Annette. 
Sauce. Sauce. Hey. Where? Nice. Ah, nice. hello. Yes, 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 yes. So, guys, uh, it's been fun um, being with you guys here. Oh my God, hi, guys. Hey. Hey. Hi. hi. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Do you, do you want me to catch my mom? Yes. I, I, I heard she left already, right? Yeah, yeah, she left. Yeah, because your father called. What, what, what do you guys do, actually? Huh? What do you guys do? Oh, we uh, did. Uh, uh, what did we do? Uh? I, 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 uh, no, we just, we just talk and, and entertain them. La. Yeah. Oh. Like chit chat, you know. Someone said like a giveaway or is it a giveaway? Okay. A give giveaway? No. What? Oh. What are why, why now what do Singaporean children talk a lot? Huh? What are yeah, hey. This kind of Can you all keep quiet now? Why you <laughs> <laughs> Well I mean if 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 they really gave you all some things, I I I hope you you all want some stuff lah. Yeah, 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 that, that, that's, yeah. Um, that's great. Thanks, Definitely guys. Definitely not your uh, things, lah. Definitely not your aw, things. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Thank you for having us, Annette. Really, really thank sweet. you. Thank yeah. you, Annette. Yeah. Everyone, give it up for Fuck of Us and Charlie Go. Thanks, guys. So sweet, ah. Huh? Like I asked them to last minute, you know, do something, and they really did it, you know. Like, wow, very nice, huh? Okay, anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Um, now we're gonna go back to doing some more music. Yeah. Um, but I won't be alone this time because um, I'm gonna be doing some songs. Um, they're gonna be really fun. They're from the Ann and Ben show. But because I'm only half of uh, the Ann and Ben show, um, let's welcome on stage my dear friend Benjamin King. Jose Bo. Jose. Jose Bo. That's all the Hokkien I know actually. But anyway guys, um, you know, uh, this is Ben and last year we came together. I wrote a bunch of songs and filmed a bunch of music videos. And uh, we even shot some scenes of those music videos right here. Yeah. Yes, in uh, Esplanade. Thank you, Esplanade. Thank you, Esplanade. This is a little known fact, right? That in K Drama Diction, one of the songs, K Drama Diction, we actually filmed a short scene in one of the dressing rooms behind. Actually, we filmed another that. scene in the dressing room, and yes, it was from the Tai Fun song. But it's true. she had to open a packet of Tai Fun that was about eight hours old. Yeah, it was so smelly, actually. Like, so, it thank was, you for it risking was your life. Rotten. Like to open it up and cry, and it was really tears of disgust. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, we're going to start off with that that song that I just mentioned called K Drama Diction. So without further ado, let's go. It's been 24 hours and 13 days without you by my side I've been sitting at home, tears on my face Got me feeling all empty inside What can I do when it's so hard? And honey, it's tearing me apart Cause all I can do is sing a song in my guitar Ever since you went and nothing filled the void in my heart My Korean drama I watched every interview on BTS I watched every show with the entire soundtrack I even clean my room just to build a shrine up I'm so true Followed all the cast on Instagram Just to me for the guys with other fans but no matter how I try, I can't find a medication for K-Drama addiction. K-Drama addiction. K-Drama Why doesn't anyone in real life tell me that I'm here? Why's nobody in a turtleneck holding around me waiting for me in the pool? Rain. I got my hopes so high Now I can't settle for less in my life Then the scene in season two Episode three When Tagi up and so I say sorry But he almost hits me at the traffic light He gets out the car and it's a snowy night He touches my, my cheek, leans in and say No options, I'm so up, so me I 
But he's gotta go back into the army, gets on a train to fight the zombies, and it dies and travels back in time. To the Chosen Dynasty, 39 and 5, goes to EJ, 1, 2, open up our kids and die Four hours and thirteen days without you by my side. Give me the box of chocolate. You want to like kiss it first and then uh, throw it? No. Oh! I don't think we can. It's it's far enough. No, 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 not not in the pandemic. We just put it. Here yeah, yeah. <laughs> See you later, Poxygen. Yeah, see you later, Poxygen. <sighs> All right. This is a song about uh, one of our favorite foods. It's a drink, though. We it's really like singing about food, huh? Yeah, we do. I realize. Um, yeah. It's a drink that we can't live without. Some people have an addiction to it. Like K-drama. What, we like to sing about addictions and food. Again, this is a G-rated show, so <laughs> G-rated yes. addictions. Yes. So, um, why are your chair so much higher than mine? This is it? I feel like I'm very small. This is not competition, okay? It's just male ego. Okay, now I'm, now I'm not. Fine. Okay, yeah, stay there, stay there. Okay, no, don't, 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 don't. At least same, same height as me. Alright, so this is a nice chill song about a, a chilled drink. Yeah. A nice chilled drink. Nice chill chilled song, song about a, a nice chill chilled drink. drink. And uh, just chill. Yeah. First day and it's going really well We go together like paper and glue We take a stroll to the ice cream shop You say I don't eat carbs and I say me too We, we like the same bands and wear the same shoes Our fingers touch about 15 times Want to catch a movie and I'll let you choose And I don't even mind if it's fast and furious night Nice! And it's time that I pop the question Shall we go to the bubble tea store? I look into his puppy dog eyes and laugh And I say no la what for? I get up and say I'm going on a drink run uh, What would everyone like to get? We're okay with anything you want uh, What about you and Nate? Nothing much I just want an old grey milk tea Avocado pudding, jelly, more pulse Less ice, 50% sugar, please I come back a little later I got everybody taping If that's okay Taping, you're taping, you I want my bubble tea, bubble tea, bubble tea Give me my bubble tea, bubble tea now I want my bubble tea, bubble tea, bubble tea Give me my bubble tea, bubble tea now Boba is Boba, not taping still now
I would like to get uh, an all grape milk tea. At, actually, no, 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 sorry, scratch that. I don't think I'll get that. Um, I think I'll, you know, actually, I'm, I'm lactose intolerant, but sometimes I just order the milk tea and I just deal with it. But I think maybe today, today I shouldn't. Uh, maybe I'll get like a fruit. Actually, no. Ben, you want to order first? Maybe you order first? Because just uh, uh, um, I think I think we can. We, oh, but the, uh, no, it's uh, okay. Uh, on the, on the hey, hello. Okay, we'll just get this. Yeah, just. It's okay. Finally, we got a bubble tea. I guess for now we will stay happy. Just. Just. Thank you, everybody. No, you're not leaving. <laughs> No, we're just going to talk about how actually Ben and I also worked on a recent project together. Um, it was my debut web series called Asian Billionaires. Anyone watched it? Yeah! So, um, what if I told you guys that, you know, you've seen the characters on screen, but today you're going to see them live on stage as well. Yeah. But before that, let's catch the trailer. Money can't buy happiness. It's something only a poor person would see. Your dad and I were planning a home holiday, doing fun things that we've never done before. Ta-da! <laughs> oh, but we're not sleeping here tonight. We'll go back to our beds. This is just for decoration. <laughs> My Ezlink card expired. Can pay in cash, right? Most of my friends, you know, they only sleep in a storeroom with just mattress. I, I also have my own TV. Very well done. Hello, Pony. Okay, everyone, now that we are gathered around the campfire, let's do some campfire songs. Let's start with El Condo Pasa. My favorite song. I'd rather be a sparrow than a snail. Yes, I would. Yes, I would. If I could. If I could. I surely would. I would. I would. Ooh. Now let's put our hands together and welcome the cast of Asian billionaires Gomit Singh, Amy J. Ching, Pau Diaz, Benjamin King, Fakafas, and Charlie Go. Hello! You're probably wondering why I have them all here today and uh, you're probably wondering why I have like a special seat. Ha! It's because we're playing a game and only I know all the answers. But yeah. if you watch the show, then uh, it's not very difficult. So um, let's go. Question number one. In episode one, the Swiss decide to go glamping in their own house. Mm -hmm. What colour is the tablecloth inside the glamping tent? What? Okay, you get 10 seconds and it starts now. What? It's just a colour. Bang! Bang! Is that how I you spell beige? I don't, guys, I don't know. I just. So okay. Ben, what is flesh? Skin, skin. It's I think you, the... you mean it skin. Means nude. I got you, nude. Bro, I got you. Did you write flesh because you don't spell beige? Yes. Okay, don't call me out. Girl. <laughs> well, let's reveal the answer. We are going to be camping. Ooh. Is it yellow? <laughs> are you colorblind? <laughs> Let's go to uh, question number two. In episode two, Paul wears an NDP shirt. What year is the NDP shirt from? Okay, anyway, so do you have a number? Do you have a year on your clipboard? Yes, I have, I have. So let's reveal. Okay. We did this to instill in them a sense of um, appreciation for. 
2018. Oh my goodness. Did anybody get that? We will. Kepala hutang kau. Y'all weren't even trying. Fair. Should, should, should I get the closest, Pao? Right? Pao is the closest. A point for the closest. Pao gets a point. Pao gets a point. Okay, she gets the point. Go Pao. Right. Point. But um, next question, episode three. Yeah. Uh, the Swiss attempt to speak Chinese for the how much did how much money did Elizabeth give out at the start of the game? Which it's very easy, you know. Oh yeah, okay. This is the easiest oh. question so far. All right, and three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> ben, you were Bitcoin. you were in the scene as well. What a very honest one. All right, let's take a look at what's the actual answer. Everyone will start up with one thousand dollars to begin with. Plus is just a stir. And that's 1,000 each for four of us is 4,000. So, next question. Um, in episode four, how long does Adam go to the toilet for? Plus, you should know this. Ah. <laughs> I'll give you a hint, okay? Okay. It's a number, point, something, something. Very specific. So, I'll give the closest uh, uh, answer. It's, it's really quick. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to give you guys three, two, one. Let me see your answers. 5.2 minutes, Ben? That's like... I'm trying to play the game. I like triple my time. Uh, so let's see how long it was. Mine was... <laughs> okay, so I know guys usually pee very fast. So, okay, it's too fast. 1.2 1. 2 2 seconds, yes. Yes, I know my timing. I know myself. <laughs> 1.8, but I mean, it, it, yeah, that was. That, you, you. you definitely got the closest answer. <laughs> Last question. <laughs> okay. In episode 5, Yan and the kids uh, bake a cake in the kitchen. What are the two colors on Victoria's apron? You know, that's very off, right? Nobody matches red and blue. Nah, you've never been to America. <laughs> <laughs> flesh and powdery. How, what's the difference between flesh and powdery? Powdery because you're baking a cake, what? So there's a lot of powder, what? That's not a So color. technically, there's a lot of powder on the apron. Ah. Uh. So let's see the answer. Cute. Ready? We just turn it to high intensity. Now we turn the mixer. Flash! Turn it off! Flash! Flash right there. That looks like flash to me. That is flashy. That is and it's wow. Brown That's and white, really flashy. Right? Okay, guys. So <laughs> slow down there. <laughs> I'm gonna um, now declare a winner based on all the questions uh, <laughs> that have been asked. I, uh, the winner, is none other than. Yay! Wow, this is like so. And okay, let's let's bring out the prize, our beautiful cash oh. prize. It's a okay. ooh. This is um, one thousand ten cent coins. <laughs> that Congratulations! Is. Can somebody do the math real quick? Again. How much is that? Hundred bucks, bro. A hundred bucks. Yeah. I don't. I don't oh, get it. Heavy. All right, let's give everyone a round of applause. Hey. <laughs> they played it very well, but before we leave. Just gonna go around and ask everyone a nice little question. Um, this is the last question that was asked in um, episode five, at the last pro uh, last episode of um, Asian Millionaires, and it's a question that is about what's worth more to you than money. So let's just get what um, everyone's interesting answers are. Hey, and let's this is the part where you have to donate, is it? Don't you donate? It's okay. I was just wondering, this is new to me, you know? I'm just... What do you say? Should I get my wallet out at yeah, this point? What do you say? Is this the part where we have to donate? <laughs> okay. No, need, no need, no need, no need. No need, no need. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Sorry, sorry, my bad. Okay, continue, please. No worries, let's, let's, start, let's start with... Let's start with Charlie. Ah. I mean, if, 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 if you want to donate, can, I will. Yeah, yeah, fast. you can donate to me, fast. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Never mind, we got a lot of coins there. <laughs> okay, what is one thing you think is worth more than money to you? Um... I would say a relationship, yeah, with people, be anybody that like, with your partner or friends. I think that's that's something money cannot buy, la. Yeah, and I think life is like that, you know. Life it's all about relationship with people. Yeah, this is the part where everybody starts to cry. Okay, okay, fast you. By the time it hits, give me that. What are you gonna answer, bro? It's, <laughs> <laughs> he's got something, he's got something. Oh, he'll come yeah, up with something. Don't, don't, he's he's got something. Don't, don't, don't go meet. I mean, like, health, health is definitely more important than money, you know? So money doesn't mean anything if you're not healthy, so... Health. 
I, I actually had an answer and then just now at rehearsal, you said it was Gurmit's answer, so I'm not gonna say. But No, I didn't. It's just I, we, I, we met. Okay, so we met the other day. And then oh, yeah. um, the, um, we, we were just talking about this and then I was asking Gurmit, like, what's worth more money? And he said, more money. <laughs> but you can take that. It is true. Uh, I think um, I think I think for me family is becoming very important um, and then families in you know different senses and uh, and also a really good hot plate of scissors cut curry rice I'm, a, I'm betraying Thai fan now because like like scissors cut curry rice you discovered to me is y'all like fun. Chris cut curry rice curry rice it's so good right why is it so good it's crazy anyway I have no idea what you're talking about yeah yeah, yeah. it's it's the am I here? We should write Nasi Padang song. We should. Okay, anyway. Oh. I was going to say family as well, relationships, family of all sorts. But I guess um, what is more than money, with, I would say, is time as well. Because um, right now, I feel like we've been so busy with work that we, well, myself personally, that I tend to ignore the time that I should be spending more with my family. So it's like time and family for me. Damn, they changed the lighting for you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, time, time, family. Aww. Let's go with Amy. I think everything that they said, but um, for me, I, I, I would feel that it is uh, having a meaningful purpose in life is worth more than money. Yeah. Got it. More money? <laughs> Let the lights go down lower. <laughs> Please give me your wallet now. And <laughs> do do not I do it. Got me I knew any it. money. <laughs> Oh, okay. okay, let's okay. be serious. I, I, you know, a lot of times when I give a serious answer, people don't take me seriously because I'm a comedian. When I go to hospital bleeding and all that, hey, Gumi, it's so funny. Blood coming out, no. Gumi! <laughs> <laughs> so, just for a second, a few seconds, I'm going to be serious. For me, what's more important than money is my wife and my three children. Because for 20 years, I was full time media corp. In 20 years, I never got a chance to say even Happy New Year because every year I was on TV saying 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. I'm the only actor in Singapore who can count backwards, <laughs> apparently. But when I finally. <laughs> no, no, no. But here's the, here's the thing when I finally left the station in 2014 December. My family and I, we took a trip on 31st December 2014. We were in an aeroplane, 30,000 feet. And for the first time in 20 years, I got to say Happy New Year to my family and we hugged. You guys are here with people um, who mean a lot to you. Um, you know, we, we let you guys come in pairs. It was a pair of tickets that you guys um, um, came up had um, when you came here. And I hope you have a very special time um, with your loved one today and really treasure these people around you. And I think that's kind of why, you know, I just wanted to have. Um, this concert where I didn't, I didn't want to charge any money and I just wanted everyone to come together and just spend some time uh, with their loved ones and yeah, I hope you guys um, are doing that and are enjoying this quality time with the person next to you so anyway, um, without further ado let's just give one final warm thank you to the cast of Picture of the Night. Yeah, so um, we're gonna go back and do a few more songs again. So I feel like for me, just like everyone, like just like what uh, everyone said just now, what means more to them um, than money, right? Um, you know, time, relationships, friends and family. Um, I think for me, uh, 
one is one more thing I'll add to that list is special experiences and being able to just experience life um, and you know do things that you never imagined that you could do and I'm gonna be singing this next next song that that means a lot to me um, I wrote the song like a couple of years back um, when I was contemplating leaving my full-time job and it was a very tough decision for me because I was unsure what was um, on the road ahead of me and it was really scary but you know uh, looking back it's it's been such a crazy ride and once again you know there's so many things that have happened that I never would have imagined in my whole life so this is a song called Crossroads um, about how sometimes it's important to have faith when you're deciding to take a new road. Probably heard this to get your own path, you gotta chart it. Well, it's always easier said than done. But how do we start? Junctions and turns, a million lanes. Truth be told. I don't know if I should stay But if you know where to go Oh, will you please lead me there? Everybody's got the best plans We built cows in the air Then stopped there Is it worth the risk to take a step? Do I dream this junctions and turns a million days? Truth be told, I'm so free. I don't know where to go. I don't know if I should say. Thank you. Hope you guys enjoyed that. 
So, yeah, Crossroads is a song that's really, really close to my heart. And like I said, I wrote in time when um, I face still of uncertainty. But I think it's really just extra meaningful singing it here today at the end of um, finding a home on this road that I've taken. And I'm so grateful for all the support that you guys have given me. And, um... And, you know, I think writing the song um, helped, really helped to give me the strength and hope um, to keep um, trusting the road ahead will be good. So if anyone's going through a time right now where you need that strength and that hope, the road ahead is good. I hope you really, really believe that and just keep going wherever you're walking. And also, I just thought it was very apt um, to share this today on Easter weekend because um, Easter is also a very special time for me. And it is um, a, a time for me where I feel it's a season of hope and I feel it's a season of celebrating um, resurrection and of all things passing and new things coming to life. And I hope that no matter in what areas of our lives, right, you feel like something is dead, um, I hope you trust and have a hope and believe that it can always be brought back to life. You know, the hope that anything broken, be it, be it your, your family, um, um, your, your dreams, or any difficult situations you're in, there will always be brighter days ahead. And so I'm going to be singing another song again that... Um, I wrote during a very dark time when I was going through a lot of anxiety. But what really got me out of a lot of all this uh, mental, mental turmoil was remembering the love that I had around me. Yeah, so um, this is a song called Remind Me and I hope you enjoy it. What is this pain that has left me Numb to the bone What is this darkness that got me clamoring What is this hurt that has no name Making me part in my own shame Feeding me so
میشن I'd just like to officially introduce the band to you guys, okay? So, first off, y'all heard them and joined them for that opening song that y'all sang along with us. Um, it was gold. Let's give a warm welcome and applause to Ivan and Maltese. They're also dancers, the professional dancers. Okay, not professional, but they were very good at the moves that, that they were doing just now. Um, and next, we have Joy on the violin and Mark on the bass. You probably heard them just now uh, during the bubble tea song. They were shredding it, okay? If you thought you heard an electric guitar um, during the bubble tea song, it wasn't. It was actually Joy doing her violin thing. Um, next, we have Han Chun on the drums. And last but not least, we have Karen on the keys. She's also our music director for the day. So, she's been telling us what to do. So yeah, um, they've been hanging out with us for the whole day and I'm glad y'all know who they are now. We actually have one more song for you guys and this is a song that I think most of you are really, really excited to hear. Uh, it's, it's actually one of my favorite songs to sing as well, so I'm super excited to be ending the show with this. Uh, it's a love song. It's a love song um, to Singaporean hawker culture. And my personal favorite hawker dish, the one and only Tai Fan. So yeah, you know, I think it, it really, Tai Fan is really what makes um, all of us so unique, you know, like hawker food just makes us all so unique. And yeah, please, please sing along. It's the last song. So just sing along with us and uh, sing your heart out. Um, so whether you are a uh, uncle or auntie, Mei or Shoiko, Xiao Mei or Xiao Di, just know you are as special as a unique plate of Thai fun. So let's go. Goes 
me swagger the way you do. Somehow it's different It's been a dream and it's been such a blast performing for you guys today. And um, I hope to see you guys again once more really, really soon. So thank you so much.